Good morning and <laughs> good afternoon, Christopher. If anyone's seen the back of his tonsils there, then you're in for a surprise. Anyway, race two down at Caulfield Spaycaster, Barry 11, 53 and a half. He's getting there slowly. Um, he's getting there slowly. He's getting there. Okay, Nectaris. She's getting through. She needs to, she's manners, manners, yeah. manners need to improve. Big time. Yeah, this is her last chance Saturday. She's got a got to shape up. She's over a suitable trip. She's got a good draw. Just needs to shape up. Yep. Man up. New mandate? Uh, he'll probably travel down from Rose Hill and... Um, Gets partnered by our old friend, Hubert. Mm. Yeah, Huey Bone, he's going, going great. Yeah, going. leading the Premiership up there, is isn't he? he? Yeah. No, he's, he's really found his groove. We had a great season last season. Family's happy. And they even got a race named after him at, on Sunday at Bathurst. Really? The Hugh Bowman Cup. That's when you know you've made it. Made it. it. That's what I thought. There isn't a Chris Waller Cup down there. No. Yeah. Anyway. Moving swiftly on. The Caulfield Guineas Prelude. Chrysler, Barrier 10. Mm, tricky gate, Charlie. We'll do the form as we like to do. And if he, if the form's good, he can head down. But from that draw, we might give him a run in Sydney instead next Wednesday. Oh, won't he be a moral Well, he could do with some confidence, couldn't he? Yeah. Do you reckon they'll open up a bet, like, three or, win by three or more for him? It's settled On down. Wednesday. It's settled down. <laughs> <laughs> Armed Forces. Barry Six. Um, first up run was okay. Um, this, like you're still a maiden running against these types of horses. It's not easy, but it's his last chance to get some stripes ahead of some big races. Otherwise, we'll, we'll lower the bar and win races, put him in races he's, he's, he's better suited to. Okay, and then into the Open 2000, Group 3, Shiraz. Awkward draw. Tricky draw, just getting some mileage into his legs. Love to see him find a spot where he can finish off strong and hopefully figure in the finish. And Timor, first up. Likewise with him. Tricky, tricky starting point, but it's just hard to find the right races. He needs mileage too. He's not not really a Melbourne Cup horse, but gee, he'd be, be suited to a race like the Lexus on the... Mm. On the Saturday. Yeah, is it the Lexus? I don't know, they change his name every year. Give Lexus a plug. Anyway. Give Lexus a plug, anyway. <laughs> anyway, uh, right, into the group one. Mm. Equal favourite for the Caulfield Cup. Equal with Francesco Gardi, our good old mate Frank. You've got Sulcum. Um, his first run was terrific. Terrific. Need a, bit, a few more adjectives there. It's bloody good, Charlie. Yeah, that's more. Um, second up, 1800, probably not quite as sharp. But I just hope it's a good, solid gallop. He's drawn mm. well. Blake Shin knows him. He's got a knock. Yeah, he, and he'll just roll and finish off strong. He'll be the eye catch. I don't know if he'll win, but he's the eye catch. And Linderman, third up. Good draw, finally. Like, just finally. Um, so that'll be a big plus for mm. him. And with Alligator Blood in the race, obviously it's a tough race. Mm. Um, hopefully he can take a sit. He doesn't need to do all the donkey work, as he's done the last three or four starts. So, look, um, I think he's ready to improve. He's fit, he's in good shape, he's travelled down well. Okay, then nipping up to Royal Toowoomba, you have Kerr Royale. I think she'll be very hard to beat if she runs. We'll have a look at the field. She's drawn really wide, mm. but they only run... A lot of emergencies. They only run 12. Gee, she was good last start, and although this is an extra 200 metres, she'll be hard to beat again. Shy Guy, first emergency? Mm. Sticky Alley? Yeah, maiden running against some good horses, probably step too far but i'd like to see him in a pressure race should have won last start should though, have, it? yeah so um he won't be far away he won't run he'll be in the top half and then step to 2000 and ranch and in the wheatwood come back good his work's been good trialing well um it's a long time since he's shown us a race form but he's come back well mm. well good luck folks what's your best <sighs> new mandate Ooh. New mandate, I think he'll bounce back. Good. His work's been outstanding. He's been sharp. Sharp. 
Well, Got to remember that James thought he was going to be his Epsom ride. He did. After he won it. Ultra. Mm. There you go, folks. So, bring it on. Bring it on next Wednesday. <laughs>